morning, everyone. It is November the 11th. It's nice and cool outside, and I hope you're having a great day. Uh, this word of wisdom is from Proverbs chapter 11, verse 17. It just simply says, A merciful man doth good to his own soul, but he that is cruel troubleth his own flesh. Mercy affects you. It affects who you are, what you are. Um, people think when you have mercy towards somebody else, I'm just doing them good. The Bible says when you have mercy towards somebody, you're doing yourself good. Uh, mercy is a powerful thing. Uh, that's what Jesus is all about, is showing mercy. Uh, that's his first step. Uh, my dad, when I was uh, a young man, just started in the ministry, I had a situation come up um, that I knew my dad was dealing with. And I said, Dad... They've been doing such and such. You just need to nail them. That was that was my my word of advice. Dad, come on, Dad. Uh, you know, PK. I know everything. And uh, he looked at me, and I had just started preaching. He said, Jason. He said that Bible you're preaching from is not just for the people you're preaching to. It's for you as well. And when it says, "He that shows mercy shall receive mercy," that's for you too. And man, it just hit me. Uh, you know, we have to be merciful. We can't just say this is what the letter of the law is. Uh, you know, mercy is above the law. Uh, and the, the Bible talks about the law was in the Ark of the Covenant. The mercy seat was on top of it. You can go through the Bible. There's so many examples of that. Jesus had the opportunity of that woman that was brought to him to absolutely slap her down. She was a sinner. He could have thrown the stone, but mercy was above the law. We need to have mercy in our lives. And if we will have mercy towards other people, it will return to us later. I promise you, God help us. But when we fall, didn't say if, but when we fall, so there's going to be times that we need mercy in our lives. And if you have not shown mercy, you're not going to have anything stored up so you can get it back. Be merciful. If you are building uh, whatever kingdom you are building, uh, Caleb had a mindset of give me my mountain. But he achieved that mountain, but in that mountain there was a city of refuge. He said, that there's going to be mercy in my mountain. There's going to be mercy in the things that I, um, I, I build in my life. And so you, you're working a job. You need to uh, be nice and have mercy to people around you on that job. Uh, you don't need to just say, uh, cut everything dry and this is just the way it's going to be. Uh, you need to be kind to people couple reasons. One time you may be going up right now, but there's another day that you might stop and they keep coming up. Uh, so you need to have mercy to people around you and uh, let God uh, open those doors. But if you will show mercy, you'll receive mercy. When you have mercy, it blesses your own soul. But when you're cruel to people, you are damaging your own self. I hope you have a good day and show some great, great mercy.